Hello, everybody. This is the Giggling Conservative. And remember, laughter is good medicine. Now, let me preface this video by saying this takes place in Australia. And this is a social experiment some guys are doing. And uh, what it is, it's these guys dressed up in burkas. And uh, they're just doing a social experiment, walking around in these burkas, checking out people's reactions or whatever. And uh, this Muslim uh, gets ticked off and starts arguing with him. And one thing that he says that I find quite amazing, uh, which shows you that Muslims are nothing more than liars, and it shows that uh, they do not come to countries for what they say they come to countries for. Uh, what they immigrate to other countries for is to impose their way of life on us, not to seek a better life for themselves. Now, this Muslim gets really mad, and there's a part in it where he makes a statement, we come to Australia to be free. Um you come to Australia to be free, but uh, you don't think that anybody else should be free but you. Uh, such hypocrites. Such hypocrites. But I found it funny that the guy got so ticked off. I mean, I thought it was hilarious that he got so ticked off. Um, you know, the thing about it is, I mean, if you can't take a joke, I don't know what to tell you. Um I mean, people joke about all kinds of religions, and we just go on with our lives. I mean, you know, it's between them and God. I mean, God's going to be the judge. Um, you know, I mean, what can I say? But like I said, you know, they said, we come to Australia to be free, but we want to take your freedom away. That's the message I get from this. But anyway, without further ado, let's take a look. <laughs> Look at that, a dude in a burka. But what's so funny is when the guy gets ticked off. Seeing how people react to people wearing full face coverings. The last, uh, let's say, challenge that we had on our list for our uh, research is this is not a protest. Okay, it was just research. Let me pause this for just a second. So this Muslim comes up and says, because this dude is wearing a burqa, that he's being racist. Okay, and so the older gentleman is saying, how is it being race racist? You know, what race are we discriminating against? And here is something that is very key. Islam is not a race. Muslims are not a race. So he's not being racist. Now, if he was putting down Arabs, that would be racist because Arab is a race of people. They're not putting down a race of people. Islam is not a race, so this guy shows how ignorant he really is. Tell us about the race. Don't name the race that we're against. Look at How about you go and make your own statements in newspapers, but take <laughs> off. Tell us what to do, mate. Tell us what to do. Tell us what to do. I can do what I want. Tell us what to do. Tell us what to do. Tell us what to do. Don't think about Saudi Arabia. Don't think about Afghanistan. Don't think about. All right, there he goes. He said, we live in Australia to be free. Okay, you want to be free, but you want to take other people's freedoms away. No, you didn't come to Australia to be free. You came to Australia to impose your way of life on other people. Australia is not trying to impose their way of life on you but you want to impose your way of life on them. If you like your way of life, why don't you go to the Middle East? That's where they live your way of life. So why are you leaving? Because you're trying to take over the world through immigration. When you become a majority, then we're screwed. Religion of peace. 
What a hypocrite. Oh yeah, that's real peaceful. Real peaceful. What a lie. Oh. Good grief. Religion of peace. That was very, very peaceful, the way he attacked that guy and shoved an elder around. Good grief. You want to be free, right? Okay. But you want to take away the freedom of others. Man, if you don't like the West, you know, and that's what, you know, pretty much European government is, they call it the West. If you don't like the West way of life, why do you come here? Why are you so ignorant? Oh my goodness. This is the Giggling Conservative signing off. And remember, laughter is good medicine.